Okay, ladies and gentlemen, Eureka! I have found it. The Eureka Power Speed Lightweight Vacuum, weighing in at only 11 pounds with a 4.4 rating on Amazon for about 80 bucks. This is the newer model, guys, the NEU280. My old vacuum finally bit the dust after sucking in a lot of dust, about a decade old. So we got this new power speed. It comes with these accessories. And I'm going to pretty much show you guys how to do a basic installation because it is a little overwhelming. It comes in a big box. It kind of looks like a cannon could be in the box. And I would like to get a portable cannon for the backyard security, but that's another subject for a different day. Um, so I'm going to pretty much show you guys just how to put this together. And, uh, you know, then you can just be vacuuming, having a good time and whatnot. Okay, guys, so first we're just going to do these little wing nuts, and these are going to be for your power cord. So all you do is you pop it in the hole like so, push it in, makes a click, and you're good. So now there's another one all the way down there, as you guys can see. So I'm going to show you that one, and then we're going to use a black one for that. All right, so you're going to have it like so. Actually, this is the proper way, because see, you'll be able to later put your little vacuum suction uh, portable unit on top of it if you want. So that just goes down here. And then again, snaps right in and you're good to go. And actually we can just put this in there right now. So you guys know, we push it down. Okay guys, and while we're back here, we have the two other vacuum attachments. Really simple. They just pop on just like that. Okay guys, so now let's attach the heavy artillery. This is the handle, and this goes on very easy too. And again, it's just a matter of knowing how to do things because it is all easy once you know. It's gonna go on the hole up top, but let me just show you. See right there? You're gonna just line that up there, right? And then there's actually release right here. Just like that, guys, and it's already in place. And there you go, you got your handle. So hopefully you can handle that. Now we're gonna hook up the hose, which is for the suction. You can see how I have these two little grooves here, right? Because groove is in the hot. So grab the one end, guys, we're using this end. And you can see they have two kind of pins. So you're gonna put it in like so. It's hard to see. So you guys just put it in there. It snaps right in. So then you go all the way up 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 over the rainbow and all the way down and then that's where you have this piece here this piece just pushes in you just push it in as far as it goes there's no clicks there's no snaps that's all it is and that's because you want it to be easy i guess if you want to use the attachment you know again use all the attachment pieces um you know you can do that nice and easy although i do wish it probably snapped in place instead okay guys so now it's complete you have the Eureka all built and ready to go. And it is really just a great vacuum. I did do a little test run. And let me show you guys the sides. And we'll go over some of the features. So let me show you guys. So you have different switches here. If you have a bare floor, some people have like, you know, they hunt, they have bare carpets. You know, that's good for that. You also have a low carpet and you go all the way to high carpet. And the switch is really easy to use, guys. I mean, easy peasy. And I was vacuuming my rug, you know, this rug just on here, on that setting, and, and it's fine. You know, it's close to the high carpet. And let me show you the other thing. Obviously, this is where your collection is going to be. You're going to be collecting all that dust that would be inside there. And let me show you the release. So there is a release button right there. You just push it down, and you go forward, and then you can just take it all out, just like that, guys. And the quick release is going to be on the back. You put that over the trash can, then it goes bye-bye. And they even give you some basic maintenance instructions right on the back, which is pretty cool. And again, one of the features I liked about this, guys, was it does have a reusable filter, which you can just clean. It's showing you. you just rinse it, let it dry for 24 hours. Um, so that was a really big plus. I don't want to buy the, the HIPTA filters. And then they're going to be taking, I don't know, 20 bucks every time. It's hard to put this back in with one hand. Um, so yeah, we got that and 
It's got some nice wheels on it too, guys. These are bigger than the other ones, so this actually is more mobile. I kind of wish the rims were chrome. Maybe I could paint them. I don't know. I always like sitting on chrome. Um, then we look at the back. And actually, let me turn this on for you guys and show you. Okay, so I did plug it in, but I wanted to show you guys this quick release, just so you know. Um, this does have a quick release. We know for the power cable, you know, which is convenient. Most of them do, but you might not know. You see the arrows, it does let, does let you know. And right down here, you can see you have the gas pedal and you have the release, which I'm gonna show you guys, which makes it pretty convenient. Now you can crank it up, there you go. And there is the release. I'll just show you a little bit of vacuuming. This is how you vacuum a red carpet. Now, and it is really easy, pretty light. This carpet's not too dirty, but you can see a little stuff. It makes it all go bye-bye. Okay, -bye. guys, I'll just show you the attachment clip real quick, how it works. Again, you can just take it off easy because there was no snap or click. So then we have it ready to go and just pick an attachment of your choice. Maybe I want to use this one. And as you can see, it pops on like so. You know, and it comes with the three different attachments you can use. Okay, guys, I think that's about it for this little tutorial demonstration installation of this great Eureka vacuum. And I will put a link in the description below where you guys can purchase it on Amazon, you know. And also, if you haven't, why don't you subscribe to my YouTube channel? I would appreciate it the same way you guys hopefully appreciated my video. So enjoy the rest of your day, night. All right, all right.